Hey guys, what's up? This is Shuri from eGadgets for you, and in this video, I will help you to update your new iPhone or your old iPhone to the iOS 16, which is available uh, right now as we are making this particular video as well. Now, I have my iPhone 13 Pro with me over here, so I'll update uh, this particular iPhone uh, to the iOS 16, and this is the very first time I'll be doing it. I have not seen and gone through any of the videos that are there regarding iOS 16 as well, so it will be a first hand experience for me as well, and I'll go through. Uh, the points that I see feel are new in iOS 16. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay guys, I have set up my iPhone 13 Pro over here and if you want to update to iOS 16, you just need to go to settings. And before doing that, let me just tell you, uh, <clears throat> the iPhone 7s are not included in the iOS 16 update. So the iPhones that came after the 7s and also the, no, uh, the original iPhone AC is not included in the iOS 16. So apart from that, the other ones, the models after the iOS uh, iPhone 7s are included in this particular update. So you go to settings, go to general, go to software update and it will check for the update. Okay, as you can see, I don't intend to update to i15.7. I intend to upgrade to iOS 16 over here as you can see over here very quickly. Let me just zoom in over here more, yeah. So this upgrade to iOS 16, I'm just going here and tapping on this particular screen. Uh, and again, going back uh, with the zoom. Yes, iOS 16 there, you can see it uh, brings a redesigned lock screen, which I'm very excited to look uh, into it and all. And yes, I am on my Wi-Fi network over here and I'll press and download and install and give the passcode. Okay, once done, you just need to wait till the download has completed but before that yes you need to go through the terms and conditions but at the end of the day you have to agree to it or else it won't work so yes the download has started and i will just pause the video over here as you can see it says update requested over here so once the download is done the next screen comes i will switch on again and as you can see over here it says preparing update so the download has already been completed over here and it's preparing the update to be installed so once the next screen comes i'll share with you and for the time being again pausing the video now as you can see that the update has been downloaded and it says install now so i click on that and it's verifying the update and as you can see that the iphone has restarted on its own you need to wait for some time the black screen will go off and the apple logo will appear soon and here it is as you can see that the Apple logo has come and yes the update uh, will install on its own you can see the progress bar over here so once it's completed I'll be back again till then again pausing the video okay now as you can see that the progress bar has completed yeah it took some time of course and again the Apple logo has appeared you just need to wait uh, because yeah it's time consuming for sure so yes as you can see after that Apple logo appears yeah the screen or uh, yeah with the welcome screen where you get the hello in different languages so i got swipe up and i'm just putting my passcode software update complete i say continue your iphone has been updated to ios 16.0 iphone analytics i don't share welcome to iphone uh, welcome to iphone swipe up to get started and here it is okay <clears throat> now before anything else, I have to go over here and finish setting up your phone. Uh, it says set up your Apple Pay, Pay and all. And yeah, Apple Pay does not work in India as of now. So I don't need to do that as of yet. But the very first thing that I need to do is need to go to settings and over here, go, okay, iCloud, uh, go to wallpaper and add new wallpapers. Yes, this is where things get interesting. As you can see over here, uh, you will get a lot and lot of wallpapers allow while using the R app, Earth and all stuff like that. This is super cool, man. This is damn cool. I need to add it here. Set as wallpaper pair. Why not? Change your wallpaper from your lock screen. Okay, as you can see that the Earth view is over here. And yes, the first thing that I need to see, of course, over here, it's a lock screen. The always on display, you will see a lot of notifications coming over here. I'm wearing my Apple Watch as well, so it's showing the status of the Apple Watch over here as well. Okay, the next big thing that uh, is there in the iOS 16 as well, I have to show it, uh, show it to you as well, because if I put the phone horizontally over here, this will actually enable me to, uh, what do you say? Yes. As you can see over here, even of putting it horizontally, it has detected my face ID uh, quite nicely. And yes, I don't need to set up the Apple Pay as of yet. And apart from that, if I go over here and the lock screen is over here, as you can see, let me just turn on the brightness uh, for now. And yes, if I uh, press it over here, 
hard press over here and why not you will see that it gives me the option to customize and before that it has used my apple id as well to unlock this particular thing and over here as you can see i can go over here and add new wallpapers over there and apart from that if i choose on customize and <clears throat> okay oh this is absolutely great if I see over here the earth detail, the moons, the moon detail, the solar system, that is super cool, man. That is absolutely cool. If I put done over here and set as wallpaper pair, nothing doing over there. And if I want to change the icons uh, in the lock screen, and the most important thing that I need to do over here is customize my lock screen. Uh, 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 of course, I'll go to the customize section over here and while i'm at it i will go and select this uh, here i can add the widgets and i can also remove the widgets that i don't want to see over here for example i don't need the apple watch notifications over there as well uh, batteries is good yeah battery sounds good battery i can put it over there so yes if i take check the battery let me just go ahead and put it over here yeah that sounds cool for now uh, apart from that, uh, there are several widgets. You can actually customize this particular thing as per your wish and will, how you want it to be. For example, if I don't want to put that over here and I want to put uh, something else, for example, the alarm clock or the calendar reminders over there. So yes, I can go ahead and put it over here like this. Just put it over there and it goes over there. I can uh, customize this particular thing as per my wish whatever way i feel like it should uh, notify me of things and stuff like that i can do it over there again the another thing that i can show you over here is that if i press it over uh, over here and get on done and customize the home screen so yeah the walls um, of course the lock screen is on the earth and if i go to the home screen over here and i go to the photos section over here i get to choose any of the photos that i have currently over here and use it and the wallpaper section as well for now let us put it that way only whatever it is over there i'm really excited about this particular lock screen i need to use it more to see that if it makes my love life easier or not st stuff like that the app screen uh, looks pretty yeah it did it, it's look as it was uh, already it's nothing new for me as of yet over here i get to find the widgets as well i get to edit and yes i get to see okay the widgets look and feel has changed over here as i can see it looks pretty decent over here yes that looks decent over here so yes there are the look and feel of the widgets have changed um and Apart from that, I need to use it much more. I will use it for a couple of days extensively and I will make a full dedicated video that will show you the extensive features that are there in the iOS 16 as well. For now, if I go to over there and you will see the about, you will see that my phone is at iOS 16 and my iPhone 13 Pro as well. So that is it guys. Hope this video was helpful. If you found it helpful, like, and share with your friends and families and also stay subscribed because the detailed video with the iOS 16 features and all will be out very very soon. Hope to catch you guys in the next video. That will be it for this particular video. Bye for now.